Here we have Braver's secondary weapon, known as Bow. Pretty iconic, and it's probably one of the most underrated weapons in the game at the moment, in my opinion. This is highly due to Katana being, well, a Katana. Because who doesn't want to indulge themselves in some anime themed weaponry? It's so addictive. However, this is where Bo comes in to snag the competition. Hopefully, that will be the case today. Bo can easily be changed with a few buffs that can boost its usage and its abilities even further. So let us dive in and see why Bo can possibly become one of the greatest ranged weapons in New Genesis. Bo is mainly used as the ranged option for hybrid bravers in most cases because it has all the tools to effectively hit enemies at a very long distance while dealing a moderate amount of damage to those targets. It works really well in team play too, by supporting your team with illuminated photonic arrows. You'll be like a Quincy from the anime known as Bleach. It can be used at close range too, but it can easily be drawn into, <laughs> no pun intended, using more simplified attacks like weapon actions and sidestep counters which does deal a great amount of damage and feels really great to use. A fantastic combination. However, you kind of do miss out on using a bow's true potential. Many of bow's charge PAs takes a little too much time to use freely against bosses who want to invite you to... Wait, a little cha-cha dance-off? Are you ready? Cha-cha, come, cha come get it. Say it again. Cha-cha, come get it. This makes using PAs like a charge dimensional ray for its extra attack benefits, kind of hard to pull off at closer ranges, which also means you can possibly lose out on accumulating extra damage, which is never really a good thing, unless you're into that. When we compare Bow to many of the other ranged weapon options out there, it holds a number 3 spot in my ranged weapon tier list, that's just behind rifle and twin machine guns, which makes it pretty good. Yes, it's just that good. The flow of the bow is probably the weapon's most noticeable trait and it exceeds most of the other ranged weapons in that category because of that fact. Each of bow's photon arts works exceptionally well with each other while also being compensated with reduced PP consumption only if you have invested points into the bow PP preservation skill so that you can find in Braver's skill tree. Alrighty then, let's now talk about the good and the bad shall we? The pros. and the cards. Overall, despite the cons, it is a superb weapon, which is the main reason why I think this weapon is very underrated. I would like to see improvements that will make this weapon a little more appealing to use over or alongside Katana for the Braver class. Here are some of my ideas. Pretty simple changes that could push the bow to the next level. It may even become the top dog for Braver. <laughs> yeah, yeah, probably not. But hey, we'll have to wait and see. Whatever changes come later this year, hopefully they're good. Well then, before then, let's talk about it down below in the comments. What would you love to see from bow from the near future? Simple or crazy creative ideas? I'd love to hear it. Alrighty, that'll be enough for me today. If you enjoyed this video, show some support by liking and subscribing. Make sure to take care of each other and as always, take it easy peeps.